Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to another video. Sorry, I just woke up, so if I'm a bit quiet and my voice is a little cracky, I'm sorry. Um, today I wanted to recreate this effect from uh, Obey Divinity's uh, latest Fortnite montage. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how to make that. And last thing, we're gonna use After Effects for this, not Photoshop or something. Okay, so you want to uh, open up the file that I put in the description. You want to download this and it contains some files. It's just some assets, so you have the same images and stuff as me. So you can easily follow along in this tutorial. So first thing we want to do is just drag in all of those backgrounds and of course the clear sky on the bottom. Then the next thing is to drag in the face logo. I want it a little bit bigger so I'm gonna pre-composition this, uh, move all attributes into a new composition and then I'm going to scale this up a little bit. There we go, let's set to like 140. So the thing that I'm pre-compositioning is uh, because the, I still want the scale of the composition to be 100 and not 140 because this will uh, mess up the mass later we don't do that so I'm gonna rename this to like face logo precom so the next step is actually really easy it's not that hard to make we want to select the right background and then uh, set the track mat to alpha inverted mat of the face logo precom and each time we want to create a mask of a nice little circle on the logo somewhere so I'm gonna click on the top background right now and I'm gonna draw a little circle mask right here we can reposition this how we like and then we're gonna click to uh, go to track mat and click on alpha inverted mat and now if we turn all of these layers off you can see that there's like a little part of the logo visible so if you're not happy with how it looks yet you can always just double click on the mask and scale it up and move it around a bit next step is to duplicate the logo precomp and drag it above the next background and of course set it to alpha inverted mat again you can turn on the background force you can actually see it we're gonna draw another circle right here a nice mask of course make it a little bit bigger than this one let's put it in the middle like that duplicate it again So like me, you just want to continue these steps until you have all the backgrounds placed and with the mask of course. And you can already see a nice little preview of the effect. So next thing is that sometimes um, the fill up of the, the, the mask, of the cover up of the logo is filled with another color, not just the, the black background sky. So how we can create that effect is actually really easy. You just want to duplicate the background again, drag it above the uh, the face logo precomp and set the face logo precomp to track mat alpha. And then you want to turn off the background layer and make the face comp logo visible so basically what is happening right now the background layer is only visible where the logo is visible and the logo is only visible where the background with the mask is visible so if you want to change the color you can just type in fill and drag that on there and just select a nice other color so i'm gonna do that as well for some of these masks so yeah i'm happy with the effect right now and then as last thing you want to add some glow so i'm gonna add a new adjustment layer oh, of course if this messes up just set this to no man we can turn down the brightness we get otherwise it's really heavy maybe turn down the width to like 60 okay so i've set the brightness to 0.6 threshold to 0.7 and the glow width to 60 so yeah as last effect you can add some clouds if you want that it look better as well as you can see in divinity's video he also made some cool stars and some depth of field somewhere uh, and you can see the slight RGB split, but yeah, I'm not gonna do that right now You just want to create this effect and then you can mess around with more effects later on So I hope all of you really enjoyed this video. Please like subscribe comment all of that stuff You know what to do and uh, I will see you in the next video. Yeah. Bye everyone